What is up, YouTube? It is your boy, Big Blue Bug, back with the new series. I'm here today playing Let's School. It is a career mode. It is a uh, like school builder simulator. I, I don't even know how else to explain it. That's kind of my understanding. I haven't watched any gameplay yet. I think we're going to go with this one. Uh, I haven't watched any gameplay yet, but I have seen a lot of reviews. Well, reviews. I have seen a lot of tweets and things on the game. And man, does it look good. It's made by the same creators of uh, the My Time series. You know, My Time at Sandrock and My Time at Porsche. And those are some, if not my favorite games of all time. Like, out of anything, I think if I was stuck on an island, I'd want My Time at Sandrock at my fingertips. Uh, letter from the old headmaster. Hey, long time no see. I'm the headmaster of your school. By the time you read this, I will be retired and traveling the world. The school you loved is in a bad state. I tried my best, but my best wasn't good enough. Now it's up to you. I'm asking you to take over the headmaster position. Please do what I only dreamt of doing. I've hidden a treasure somewhere on the school grounds. If you revive our school, the treasure is yours. Okay. Uh, John Smith, uh... <laughs> no, it could ruin. Uh, I'm pretty tall. I'm a pretty... Sk I'm a relatively skinny boy. I got a little flow going on right now. We got anything that looks like it's got a little flow going on? This looks pretty good. We could work with that. So I'm supposed to be a headmaster. I feel like Headmaster needs to dress nice. I got a mustache goatee. Is that Johnny Depp? We'll go with the mustache. Move that bad boy. Looking good, Noah. Hey, school information. My school. Well, this is a big... Blue bug. Uh, big blue bug. Mm, big blue. Big blue. School name. School name. School name. University. Nope. That can't fit. I'm gonna name it Big Blue FC. I prefer to be in the blues, please. That looks nice. Uh, outline? Oh. I kind of like the circle. Color two. Alrighty, let's see what's going on. I think I was supposed to pick outfits, but you know what? Everyone looks good. It's fine. There I am. Looking ready to run a school. Big blue FC <laughs> football club. <laughs> I couldn't fit anything else there. I'm sorry. No, it's just how the cookie crumbles, right? Wow, look at that little, that little arm shake there. Are you the new headmaster? I am. I'm Miss Lynn, your assistant. Okay, okay. Feel free to ask me if, uh, ask me for help if you encounter any difficulties. I might not have a lot of experience, but I'll do my best. Yeah. Thanks. It's not easy being a headmaster. Oh, I haven't been. I haven't been told about your past work. Yeah, I need help. Try moving the camera. Okay. I think I can. I think I can handle that.
Oh, okay. I didn't... That's cool that you can rotate it. There's more than one floor to this building. Let's go upstairs. Ah, nice. Go to lower floor. Oh, this is a cute school. Looks like you're already getting a hang, getting the hang of adjusting perspectives. Great. Let's see what we have, what we have to do to run a school. Education goals. Hello, headmaster. Let me introduce you to our first goal. We must admit students from all the communities around us and satisfy their needs. Have the students attend class so that uh, they can gain knowledge points. Okay. Uh, throughout the week, teach the students so that they can pass the exam for their preferred course type for the preferred course type at the end of the week when the students pass the exams the school gains contribution points which can be used to further improve the school okay you can increase the school level by renovating the facilities admitting new students and more please gain a higher score to up the level of the school let's aim for the best okay hey Clean up the abandoned facilities. Greeting, Headmaster. I'll be building your, uh, I'll be your building consultant, Brick Johnson. <laughs> Brick Johnson. Uh, that's what they used to call me in high school. This building hasn't seen regular use in ages. I'm sure you don't want your students to see this place look like a dump. Let's tidy it up first. I agree. Let's tidy it up. Demolish? Oh, okay. We're just demolishing what's in it. Uh, I've seen this place. I've never seen this place so clean and tidy before. We can now focus on our first day. Uh, let's first build a classroom. Uh, I think first classroom comes over here. Six by four is a 24... I just do that. Oh, this is going to be a tiny classroom. Do they need space to get into their seats? I don't know. Hello, I'm Edison Lin. Uh, Liu. Liu? I'm Edison Liu. Uh, the school's teaching consultant. It seems like you're ready to recruit some students. Uh, they are school's foundation. Visit the community center. I go to the community center. I'm like, hey, guys, I opened up this little cute little school. This is where the potential students of our community are gathered. There are a lot of children in this community who can start in our school soon. We can establish an administration's office, admissions office here so that students may send their applications. Uh, estimated nine applicants per week. Okay, okay. Student type forgetful. Well. And then I make one... T t cool. Cool. I don't know. Sure. Uh, yeah, we kind of got to admit all, huh? Come on over, boys and girls. It is time to assign new students to a classroom. Home room teachers are needed to manage students. Otherwise, the students will have disciplinary issues. Now assign a teacher. Miss Lynn, you're in. <laughs> Class preparations are now complete. Let's unpause the and let the school activities continue. During daylight hours, students and teachers will come to start a new day of life at school. Okay. 
Headmaster, headmaster, come to the school gates to welcome the new students. Yay! I love this art style. Let's see if they have any problem getting into their seats. Our parents said we aren't small enough to study. We aren't smart enough to study, but we never believe them. I hope Big Blue FC can help those from Verdant, Va Verdant Valley make our dreams come true. I just want to see that you guys get into your seats okay. Okay, yeah, there's no issues here. Are you guys blind? Lighting. Oh. Well, what the heck? I love that I made it an odd number. So now I have to... I'm just going to go like this. Oh, they got a schedule. These are the estimate. These are the estimated exam results. Okay. Uh, head schedule. Uh, ac academics, human humanities, science, sports, arts. Next page. Uh, let's see. The estimated exam results are displayed. Okay. Uh, these. Okay. So they're all gonna fail right now. Uh, exams will be held every Friday. The students' grades will be determined by the knowledge points they gain. Students who reach the weekly goal will uh, con earn, give contribution points to the school. After every exam, students will go by a year. Go up by a year. After three exams, students will proceed to graduation. Students who pass their third exam will be accepted by their target institution. This will give the school more contribution points. Cool. Next, schedule some courses. Okay. Throw that on there, that on there, that on there. Ooh, we don't have teachers for this? Okay, can I just delete this? Go that and that. Then I guess we can just do that and that first period every day for now. Now, I don't know what to do with the second half of the days. Literature 101 and Science 101. Schedule one week of courses for any class. Oh, so we have to do the whole week. That makes sense. Uh, well... I guess you're doubling up on literature and science, my sweet children. Okay, you can just right click it. Okay, so I guess that's their days are very simple, easy, simple day. Oh, well, they need something in those last two periods. Ooh. Well, right now, I don't know what we're doing Friday, so we're going to throw these in there. for. We'll throw in art and sports, I guess, for now, but we're going to need teachers for that. Okay, they got the lights they need. They're now learning. Alright, so I feel like we should, uh... Well, I don't need a humanities... T I don't need any of these. I need, uh, education, I guess. I guess I could th have one of these people be the, uh, science teacher instead. Uh, let's make a science room, I guess. 
uh, build. Classroom, management office, research room, headmaster's room. Oh, there's no men's and women's room? Oh, well, let's build a couple of those. Whoop. Minimum 12. Check. And let's do the same thing here. So now we got a couple bathrooms. Ah, uh, yep. Let's uh, take my free money, of course. We got another teacher over here, so let's go ahead and we'll fix up this wall quick. We'll get this side working. So over here we could do another classroom. How big? 20? Okay, so this side's a little bit bigger. So what is this? This is... So that would be 6 by 4, so that would be big enough. Okay, and now we just need, what, a light? Couple lights. Like that. Now we got a second classroom going. Check. Sweet. Hello, Headmaster. I am Miss Sweets, the school lifestyle consultant. The students request a tea room so they, so that they can uh, have, so they may have drinking water. Hmm. You should do your best to satisfy all requests to ensure good quality of life. Okay, can I just say this game's so freaking cute? Tea room. Where do we think a tea room goes? How big does a tea room need to be? I kind of want to use this space is the problem. Was that going to be too small for a tea room? Or what if I went like this? Okay, we met the size requirement. Uh, and a door. Let's go with a single door, like that. We got a tea room! You've built a tea room, finally! The students uh, can quench their thirst. Hydration's very important. That's actually kind of so cute. Can we just talk about how cute this game is? I actually, just starting really into it. The teacher's quenching his thirst too.
Can I put the other teacher on these? How do I switch teachers? Oh, wait. Oh, you know what I could do? I just go uh, to the calendar. I go to the second one. And here, what we could do is throw this on. And maybe we could... Nature calls. Toilets. Oh, they have toilets. Um... Okay, so right now... Okay, so right now it's just the one room. So what we need to do is just switch the teacher. The teacher... Change teacher. You should be the teacher there. What's the problem? Teacher not... Uh, proficiency not met. Okay, well, one sec. Well, we need to have you do it. And then I guess over here we could throw... Uh, Well, we need to get the teacher trained. So how do I train the teacher? Exceeds... Tr tr cost 10... Okay, well... Is he now trained? Is that how that works? It's that easy? Okay, so now let's go ahead and change the teacher. Go to the calendar, this room. Can I now change teacher to you? What aren't you proficient in? Nope, keep it as Noah. Let's continue training him, I guess. Teacher, teacher, teacher. Teacher's in training. Oh, he's already training, okay. Do I need to build, like, a training room? Manage all facilities except for the principal's office and sharing management pressures. Huh. Research room. A place where teachers can research. Well, I don't want to add students here. I don't want to add students there if the teachers aren't proficient in what they're teaching. I'm not going to do that to our poor students. Sports teacher? Can I now throw in sports? Training has started. After some time, the teacher's proficiency will increase. Cool. Can I add sports now? Can we uh, get rid of maybe one of these? Uh... Will that help them learn? I Oh, they have no exam in sports right now. Oh, well then we should probably just keep them up with science. I'll throw in a couple sports things just to like give e people a break, but... I'm actually so excited for this game. I'm kind of annoyed that my one staff isn't good. Oh. Uh, I'm going to admit them all to the same room as the other students for now, because that's where our calendar is made. Uh, students. Uh... Yep, now we got a full classroom. That'll be good. As that one guy's training. I think this is a good place to call it. I really appreciate everyone's time and viewership. If you're excited for this series, honestly, this game seems 
so in depth. I'm so excited. But if you're excited for this series, make sure you hit that like button and make sure you subscribe to see what happens to Big Blue FC. I'll see all of you in that next video. Alrighty, guys. Bye.